Hey guys, welcome back to the Vin Review. It's Abba Melvin, and today we are talking about Catherine Bernardo and following multiple people within Filipino showbiz. But before we get into this video, please subscribe to this channel for more content. And yeah, let's get into it. So today we are talking about Catherine Bernardo and Daniel Padilla again, because Catherine Bernardo recently unfollowed Daniel Padilla, Julia Barredo, Liza Soberano, and Julian Vicenzo on Instagram. Okay, so these are you know a few people and she unfollowed all of these people in one night now we all know why she has unfollowed daniel because daniel is her ex you know boyfriend i do not know why she has unfollowed liza and why she has unfollowed julia but ask me why she has unfollowed you know julian vicenzo now word on the street is that julian vicenzo is the current girl that is being linked to you know daniel padilla and so for some reason catherine feels like she's making some sort of a statement by doing the follow and unfollow game which according to me this is getting tired and boring and redundant okay like these two broke up okay and after breaking up they have been seen together multiple times so for us we think they have a cordial relationship okay but for her to go out of her way and unfollow follow you know daniel padilla and the girl who he is currently being linked to you know it, it's kind of giving bitter you know according to me but then again people are saying that julian vicenzo could be the girl who led to the breakup of Catherine bernardo and you know daniel okay so this is where it gets confusing because we all knew that it was andrea brillantes but now the script has been flipped and it's julian vicenzo now remember julian vicenzo was in too good to be true with Catherine and daniel okay so this is just so messy like it's so so messy like we do not even know where the truth is right now like and then again she unfollowed all of these people in one night she knew exactly what she was doing she knew that people were going to dissect this situation like we are doing right now and she knew that there was going to be some sort of a conversation so i feel like this is in a way like sending some type of a message okay like yeah she's really trying to send a message i do not know um what the message is i'm trying to decipher the said message but Catherine is definitely trying to send a message and she's really playing a dangerous game here because remember when she unfollowed um, Andre Belantes and everyone was dragging Andre Belantes but now they have exchanged the girl. Now it's not Andrea, it's Jillian. So who is it? Who is the reason why Kathniel broke up? Who is the girl that is the third party? Is it Andrea or is it Jillian Vicenzo? We need to know. Please stop confusing us. Anyway, guys, what do you think about this drama? Do you think that it will ever end anytime soon? Because I feel like it's time for them to like hang it up. It's becoming boring. Okay, do not forget to like, comment and subscribe to the channel and have an amazing day. Bye.